Police say the man driving this yellow checker cab is 35-year-old Luis Garza. They say just moments before this camera caught Garza behind the wheel of the stolen cab, the woman in the back seat ran into the car screaming that this man was trying to kill her. Please do it, please. Investigators say shortly after she got into the cab, Garza jumped in and started beating her. Then police say Garza turned on the cab driver. At that point, the gentleman was violent. He came and he was yelling and he was banging on the car and, and yelling at the girl and she was already fear for her safety, so he, he took it upon himself to exit the vehicle. Miguel Constancio is the operations manager with Yellow Checker Cab Company. He says the driver immediately called 911. And he says drivers know that there are procedures in place to protect them and their passengers. In many cases, they can monitor cabs at all times thanks to a GPS tracking system. And he says cameras are installed in most of all the cabs. Some capture video, others take still pictures so they can document everything. It takes pictures, it's programmed to take it a certain way at certain points, but there's also a manual photo in case they have previous or prior concerns, like I was mentioning before. They can actually push a button and it will take a photo. In Sunday night's case, police have this video to work with, but the camera didn't capture everything. Police say Garza eventually rammed into a car after taking the cab. Witnesses say the two men inside that car chased Garza, pinned him down, and waited for police. I didn't have no taxi cab. I was walking. They just arrested you for no reason, huh? Yep. Garza was charged with robbery and evading arrest. In the meantime, the driver of the cab was not seriously injured. Constantio says this only serves as another reminder of how dangerous their jobs can be. No! Now, the cab driver in this case was back on the job today in a brand new taxi. And we understand the woman involved was eventually located, and police say she was not seriously hurt.